Hey guys, what's up? This is Dylan from Upstate Merch and Shirt Show. Uh, I just wanted to show you real quick how fast it is to set up an online store with Inksoft. So just click Create Store. I'm gonna name this store Shirt Show. I wanna make it Shirt Show, shop.upstatemerch.com slash shirt show. Public, yes. All my information is already in here. You don't have to do anything with that really. Uh, so I want to upload store logo. So this will be what's at the top of the store. So let's see. That one. And then this is the icon that shows up in the top corner. There you go, good to go. No, I don't want an online designer. I mean, you can add one if you want one. Uh, I'm gonna do on demand because I wanna have stock. Uh, if you wanna just do a pre-sale, you can do expected production date. Shipping methods, yes. So I have, again, this is automatically in there. Uh, USPS first class and USPS priority. Uh, I don't want to have people pick stuff up. Uh, this again, check out settings. It's already in there. You don't really have to do anything unless you want to change it. Custom checkout fields, no. Uh, do I want to get emails daily about, you know, if I'm going to get a sale or not? I do daily and I just, that way I can see what's coming in. Here I can add links for shirt show. So here I'm going to put shirt show official I'm just going to do those two for right now store policies again these are all generic ones you can leave or you can edit them if you want uh, no I want to use my shop that upstate merch domain not the different one okay, it's all done so I can go to style editor. I uh, don't have to go too crazy. I'll upload the logo real quick. Pop that in there. I like this layout with it in the center. Make that a little bit bigger. Uh, let's change the background color to black. Okay, that's good. And then let's change this. I really like this layout better. Change the background color to black, just because. Save changes. So you can see the little icons up here at the top. Logo's in there, good to go. So I'm gonna go to store admin. I'm gonna create a new product. So here you have all the products that you want that I have that I normally offer. You can search other ones if you want to. Um, I like the 3001 CBC. So I'm gonna add a color. I'm gonna change it to black Heather. I'm gonna upload the logo. So I'm gonna do a vintage shirt show logo. Click it. Make it what size I want it. Place it where it should go. That looks pretty good. Create product. Okay, so here I'm gonna go to the 3501 long sleeve that I want. Change the color to black. And I'm gonna add my logos for that. Anti-left chest. So I'm gonna add that to the left chest, change the size, place it where I want it. Pretty good. 
So I'm going to pick the back, upload the logo, anti back, put the back on there, change the size. Looks good. Create product. Go to product details. So now I've got both of those in there. So I'm going to change this one to vintage shirt show. I change this one to anti sleeve print print club. Do 20 bucks for this because we want it to be cheap for you guys. $15 for this. Finish. So I like to go here and categorize them a little bit. I'll push put t shirts. You don't have to do this. And then I'll go in here and edit it real quick. If I, you don't have to again, but I want to make a couple changes. I don't want to have to show the backs and the sides because there's nothing on it. Um, here you can change the descriptions because we're all printers. I'm going to go ahead and make this say unisex Bella canvas 3001 CBC because I want you guys to know what we're printing on because you already know all about all this stuff. But if you were selling to a customer, you probably wouldn't put that. You would just make it so they knew what the blend was. Uh, here's the sizes that are available. I'm going to go ahead and take 4X and 5X off. Uh, size charts, you can put that in there if you want to. I have a bunch already together, so I'm going to go ahead and put that one in there. Okay, I'll go back. I'll do the same thing to the long sleeve. I want the front and back, but here I want to show the back off more than the left chest. So I'll swap those. So this is a default. Go again in here, take off the stuff that was there. We'll do unisex Bella canvas 3501, 100% cotton long sleeve. I want to write with orange discharge print because I want all the printers that buy this to know that it's going to be nice and soft. Again, it's got small through two X choose file. Okay. Let's go back to style editor, manage products. I want to add both of these T's. Bam, done. So I can save and publish. Go back. This is it. This is the store. It's done, ready to go. You can put it up, send it to your customer. For in our case, we're just going to put it live. So if you guys want to buy one of these sweet shirts, you can. Here's the thing. You can zoom in on it, look at it. It's pretty cool. Description's down here. Uh, shirt color, shirt size, and then you can add to cart and check out. Here's the back, left chest, good to go. Sizes are there, it's all set. Seriously guys, you should get this, for real. It's uh, super good, super clean, super easy to set this up. Before it would have been a nightmare for me to do this. Yeah, it's awesome, just do it. Well, if you didn't hate listening to my voice, then maybe you should check out the Shirt Show podcast I do with my buddy Andy from ShirtCon. We have a new episode out every Monday. We talk to all kinds of people in the print industry about tips and tricks and what it's like to run a print shop. Catch it on all streaming platforms. Don't forget to rate and subscribe. Thanks, guys. See you later.